let's go, let's go. Welcome to part two of Assassin's Creed 3. And this why I start celebrate America Day. Even though, uh, actually by the time this video is out, it's actually not quite 4th of July yet. Oh no, little kids. Gotta get away from them. Little kids are annoying. Anyways, um... Yeah, we're not quite there. <laughs> God damn! I could just get bit smacked by Benjamin Franklin. <laughs> this accursed city will be the death of me. You seem troubled, friend. That's because I am greatly so, in fact. What's happened? I was robbed. The old Balkan file. And though I've managed to restore what's mine, I fear it's ruined. You mean the book? This is no ordinary book. It's an almanac. The first I ever wrote. <clears throat> Benjamin Franklin, pleased to meet you. Hatham Penway. You must be new to Boston. Why do you say that? You're still possessed of virtue. <laughs> to stop and help an old lout like myself. I... I don't mean to impose, but... You seem a spry fellow. Should you happen to find my missing pages, I'll reward you. Look, I'm not sure if I... It's all right, all right. If you have the time, hurrah! If not, no harm done. The thing is useless in its current state anyway. But, should you somehow manage to restore it, you'll find me inside that general store over there. Uh... Anyone else see those people just disappear? I just went... Well... That was interesting. Oh, an interesting fellow, man. Maybe one day he'll be famous. Come and enter, please. Alright, so yeah, we need to arm ourselves up because I guess for some reason the, they decided not to let us bring our weapon aboard from England. But then again, I mean, I'm pretty sure back in those days uh, any passenger weren't allowed to carry uh, weapons on them. I don't know. I wasn't there, so. That'd be an interesting thing to look up, though. Alrighty. Weapon wheel. Ah, okay, so that's how we do it. Uh, geez, weapon wheel. Weapon large weapon. We ride for the Green Dragon Tavern. The proprietors are eccentric, but the rooms are spacious and they do not cry. Have you been told why it is I've come to Boston? No. Master Birch said I should know only as much as you saw fit to share. He sent me a list of names and bade me ensure you could find them. And have you had any luck with that? Aye. William Johnson waits for us at the Green Dragon. How well do you know him? Not well. But he saw the order's mark and did not hesitate to come. Prove yourself loyal to our cause. And you may yet know our plans as well. I should like nothing more, sir. Oh, the minimap looks so updated, too. I like that. That looks way better than how I remember it. So. Yeah, this is honestly surprising. Usually when Ubisoft remastered the game, they just look the same, but this is does look upgraded. Like, I can just totally tell. Like, I haven't played the, uh, the original Assassin's Creed 3 in years, but I can already tell that this looks different. And you know what? I'm actually down for it. My personal views, anyways. Usually, uh... Usually I don't do... I just saw another ghost up there. Oh! I just saw two people disappear. Wow. That was crazy. So, speaking of remasters, I guess? <laughs> A lying, cheating, no good son of a bitch. Perhaps we've come at a bad time. Oh, don't be foolish, dearies. Please, sit. Fancy something to eat? A drink, perhaps? Or is it a bed you require? We've already let rooms here. Uh, oh, yes. Uh, of course. 
Masters Lee and Kenway, uh, was it? Ah, uh, I'll have your bags brought up. Uh. Do you require anything further? Only privacy. Uh. This way. Oh, this game's gonna be so, so fun. <laughs> William Johnson. A pleasure. A good lad. If a bit earnest. <clears throat> I'm told you're putting together an expedition. We believe there's a precursor site in the region. I require your knowledge of the land and its people to find it. Sadly, my research has been stolen. Without it, I'm of no use to you. Well, let's go get a bag. We'll find it. Do you have any leads? My associate, Thomas Hickey, has been making the rounds. He's quite good at loosening tongues. Well, tell me where I can find him. I'll see if I can't speed things up. <clears throat> We've heard rumors of bandits operating from a compound southwest of here. You'll likely find him there. Charles? Sir. We'd best be off. Of course. Oh, no, that's not kind of season. So I'm scared. And, uh, if I can activate it, come on, game. Yeah. Tell me about yourself, William. What's to tell? I was born in Ireland to Catholic parents, which I learnt early in life severely limited my opportunities. So I converted to Protestantism and journeyed here at the behest of my uncle. But I fear my uncle Peter was not the swiftest of men. He sought to open trade with the Kanyan Gahaga but chose to build his settlement away from the trade routes, instead of on them. I tried to reason with the man, but... <sighs> as I said, not the swiftest. <laughs> so, I took what little money I'd earned, and bought my own little plot of land. That was pretty I swift. I built a home, a farm, a store, and a mill. Humble beginnings, but well situated, which made all the difference. So this is how you came to know the Mohawk? Indeed. And it has proved a valuable relationship. With still no mention from your contacts of the Precursor site? No hidden temple or ancient constructs? Yes and no. Which is to say, they have their fair share of sacred sites. Earthen moons, forest clearings, hidden caves. But nothing matching what you describe. No strange metals. No odd glows. Hmm. It is well hidden. Even to them, it seems. But cheer up, my friend. You'll have your precursor treasure. I swear it. To our success, then. And soon. Alrighty. Pretty stand-up guy. Yes, I, like, I'm sure your life wasn't easy for him, but, you know. Uh, cool thing about this game, by the way. Basically, all these main characters, like those two and uh, the people we're going to be picking up, it basically, in like any of our targets, were actual real people in history. So one th cool thing that uh, Assassin's Creed has always done is uh each target um and every game were actual real people and their time of death was actually historically accurate most of them uh actually disappeared so it's pretty sick so ubisoft they know their history and as a history buff like myself that's why it's one of my favorite series thomas hickey who's asking Haytham Kenway. Is that supposed to mean something? Show some respect, boy. Peace, Charles. William Johnson sent us in the hopes we might expedite your search. We don't need no expediting. Don't need none of your fancy London speak, neither. I found the men that done the theft. Then why are you just lazing around? Figuring out how to deal with those varlets. I have an idea. Well, let's hear it. I'll kill the lookout. Take up a position behind the guards. Uh, you two approach from the front. When I open fire on the group, you charge in. We'll have the element of surprise on our side. Half will fall before they've even realized what's happened. All right. 
There's one of our boys on our list, Thomas Hecky. I wonder why he did in history. Get into position. But wait for me to take the first shot. Oh yeah, it's back in those days when Blintlocks only had one round. Oh, how times have changed. Wait, can I actually climb with this weapon? Yes, I can. Holy shit. Go on now, before you make us mad. with the rifle fingers. so much for the element of surprise reinforcements oh okay <laughs> Ow. come on bitches let's go okay sure Get away. Okay. <laughs> I'll just slice you like that. Fall back! Fall back! We'll be safe inside! What now? We can blow the door with those. Go on, shoot them. No matter if I do. Oh, just give me one second, boys. Oh yeah, that's the nice tw 2012 reload. <laughs> On with the show then. Knock knock. Guess they wasn't so safe inside after all. Lay down your weapons. Then I'll consider letting you live. I make you the same offer. We've no quarrel. I only wish to return this chest to its rightful owner. Nothing rightful about Mr. Johnson. I won't ask again. Agreed. As always you want. Your kind has no need for books and maps. Who put you up to this? Never seen a person. It's always been dead drops and letters. But they always pay, so we do the jobs. Well, those days are done. Tell your masters I said as much. <laughs> Who should I say you are? You don't. They'll know. Savage. <laughs> Ain't them so savage. Hey, Fum, this one's got some shot on him. You might want to be grabbing it on account of your pistol being parched. Back to the Green Dragon then. I need a drink. Uh, camera. Can't look up. Now let me look up for some reason. There we go. That's weird. Careful, gents. We've company. Don't let go of the chest, Charles. We'll take care of this round. Wait, them bodies is sure to have loot on them. Would be a shame to let it all go to waste. Are you mad? In case you've forgotten, we're in the midst of something. Ah. Why's you always gotta go and spoil the spool? I see someone running over there with a the rifle.
clothesline off the roof? Oh my god. With knives. They ain't so tough. It's not the scoundrels I'm concerned with. God, <laughs> I'm sorry, that was awesome. Oh, that was so insane. Another guy over there, yes it is. Nut shot for you. I don't know that ain't good. Mr. Johnson's gonna need to double my pay after all this if he expects me to keep at his side. There you are. My thanks, Master Kenway. No. Tell me what it is you'll need. The images on this amulet, are they familiar to you? Perhaps one of the tribes has shown you something similar. It appears Kanyan Gahaga in origin. Can you trace it to a specific location? I need to know where it came from. With my research returned, perhaps. Let me see what I can do. Thomas! What? Rent yourself a room. And a bath as well. <laughs> I suspect we'll be here for a while. All right, all right. So we got the so we got a club going on now. Awesome. All right. Let's go and talk to our boys some more. Get to know them what better, if I can. Game, game, game. Yeah. Any news? Whispers of things. Nothing solid at the moment. I know you're looking for word of anything out of the ordinary. Dealing with temples and spirits and ancient times and whatnot. But, so far, can't say my boys have heard much. No trinkets or artifacts being moved through your... shadow market? Nothing new. Couple of ill-gotten weapons, some jewelry likely lifted from a living thing. But you said to listen for talk of glows and ums and strange sights, right? And I ain't heard nothing about that. Keep at it. Oh, I will. You done me a great service, mister. And I fully intend to repay my debt, thricefold if it pleases. Thank you, Thomas. Place to sleep and meal to eat is thanks enough. Don't you worry, I'll get you sorted soon. Boy, right on, mate. Do this. Time to get the next person on the list. Evening, gentlemen. Uh, Tony. Uh, yeah. Oh, peace, Charles. Competition? Oi! Catherine, you fussock! Get back here! Daddy needs a drink. How fares the search? Maths and maps are not cutting it. What of your local contacts? We'll need to earn their trust before they'll share what they know. <sighs> oh, I have an idea on how we might be affecting that. There's a man who's taken to enslaving natives. Rescue them, and they'll owe us. <laughs> Do you know where they're being held? Afraid not. Benjamin Churchwill. He's a finder and a fixer. 
He's also on your list. And there I was, wondering whom I might solicit next. Well done. Next member of our boys club. Ding dong. I mean, can't argue. We got. In, I mean, we're inside now, so. Seems like we're not the only ones looking for Mr. Church. Damn it! He could be anywhere. Does he seriously have a painting of himself what do we do? on the wall? We find him. They have a narcissist, don't you say? Come. I'll show you how. Ah, uh, snap. Was like, we're gonna be doing some assassin training. What, what? That's yeah, one cool thing about this game is that, uh, or about the Assassin's Creed is that you don't just go and find your target and then just, you know, kill him. You gotta uh, eavesdrop, you gotta find them. If we the best of you know, a little detective work. But if you could have seen it. They were surely drunk carrying on like that, and during the day, no less. Hi. Move between two civilians to Hear ye! My royal charter of King George the Second! Of scandalous behavior from one who aims to be a surgeon. And one cool thing about being an assassin is that. You know, they hide around corners and stuff like that. They gotta be stealthy and all that. But uh, perhaps I should send someone. One of their mottos is you hide in plain sight. Damages his reputation beyond repair. Uh, they stumbled off. Makes a lot of sense. No doubt, in search of a tavern or some other place of ill repute. Start questioning those on the street. I'm headed for higher ground. And I think if we. I think if we're doing what we're about to be doing, so this is when uh, we secretize the town. So what assassins are meant to do is obviously they're learning to climb and shit. And uh, in order to get the layout of the town that they're in, what they have to do is to climb like a really tall building, uh, go out on the ledge, and yep, we're actually doing it right now. Find a really tall building, go on, you know, get to the top, and just uh, get the layout of the land. And then, basically for gameplay reason, like if you notice the mini map is a little bit dark in around areas, that's because I haven't been there yet. But once I'm there, it'll like light up permanently. But if I go ahead and uh, go into these tall towers and uh, you know synchronize, get the layout of the land, uh, that area, uh, that uh, part, will um, show up on my mini map. So I can't do that, so get the entire map. Thing. Let me see. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, see all these darkened areas are places I haven't discovered yet. But once I, uh, once I synchronize this viewpoint, you'll see what I mean. Time to take a listen. And boom, see? So yeah, so there's like a million of these, but uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do them all. With luck, that. one of those people knows what became of Benjamin. Here's what cool thing about assassins do. Hey, thanks. That's so satisfying. Down 
here. I'm half the prize, but they all plead ignorance. Bugger that! They're lying! Aye. Well, what can I do? Threats light off them, and I'll not deign to grovel. Actions speak louder than words, my friend. Arrest one and put him in stocks. See if he's so glib then. To do so without cause will set them singing songs about us. Last thing the city needs is town criers complaining about our abuse of authority. And forget it. The crime is done. The killer's gone. Those who know won't share their secrets. If the city wishes to harbor scoundrels, let them pay the price for it. Find our next uh, thief drops target. on the roof too because they'll just start screaming at you get down like instantly it's kind of annoying to be honest i asked if i could help and they waved me away insisted it was all under control how odd did they say what had happened no only that it was a trifling matter and he'd be returned home soon. There was some blood, though, so I wonder if it wasn't more serious than they let on. Where were they taking him? Towards the hilltop. Perhaps there's a doctor at the fort. Uh, while we're here, we'll go ahead and uh, synchronize this place, too. All I know is it can't be good. Probably looking for a nice, quiet place to do the deed. From what I hear tell, his work usually involves quite a bit of screaming. Which reminds me, we'd best not buy any meat to the <laughs> Good call, that. Ugh. Sounds hella brutal. See, Charles? We'll have church in no time. Just as I said we would. If I might ask, sir, where did you learn to do all this? It is a requirement when you are raised in the manner that I was. Yeah. You'll learn soon, my boy. Order. It guides the feet when running and climbing, informs the hands when striking and fighting. But most important, it transforms the senses, and we begin to know the world in a different way. It's really beautiful here, then. It's tearing up right now. Alright. Careful. The place is well guarded. <laughs> I need to slip past them. Let's uh, find higher ground so we can get a way out the uh, what we're dealing with here.
Uh, according to the minimap, there's a guard right below us. I'm gonna be careful with them. Fuck off now, kid. Oh shit, there's a guy behind me coming up. They're gonna see the body, unfortunately, but I won't. Or not. Alright, cool. Stay close to allies. You need to get his ass down here. Come on, fam. I tried to double assassinate, but I guess the game plan. Mm, nah, not today. Still on the technically I'm still undetected. I'm gonna fuck what the game says. Hey, for him, come on. Find the key. Wait here. Just in case he decides to turn. Uh, Hathen, I needed that key. Wait, can I still get it though? No. Way to go. you always make these things so difficult, Benjamin? Merely provide me with recompense, and all shall be forgiven. I'll not pay for protection I don't need. Clearly, you do require protection. Else we wouldn't be here. How very gutch. Now, what shall we do about our guest? Maybe. I take his hands. Put an end to his surgery. Maybe. I take his tongue. Put an end to his waggling. Or maybe. I take his cock. Put an end to his fucking us. So many options. I can't possibly decide. Take all three. No! Hold a moment! Perhaps I was. Hasty in refusing you earlier. I'm so very sorry, Benjamin. But that door has closed. Be reasonable, Silas. I rather think I was. But you took advantage of my no. generosity. I won't be made a fool a second time. <sighs> I fear I lack the constitution to bear witness to such barbarism. Come find me when you're finished, Cutter. You'll regret this, Silas! Do you hear me? I'll have your head! No. I rather think you won't. Still a minute. 
Let's save our boy before he gets uh, chopped up. Must be so very proud to have raised a specimen like yourself. Quiet now. I need to concentrate on me work. How about you uh, go and break forever? Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, that was really not good. <laughs> who? Who are you? Hatham Kenway, at your service. I, I don't understand. Why are you here? Uh, walk with me, Mr. Church, and all will be explained. Johnson's told me what you intend. As it happens, the man who held me is the same one that you seek. His name is Silas Thatcher. That fancy lad is our slaver. Don't let his velvet tongue deceive you. A crueler and more vicious creature I've never known. What can you tell me of his operation? He hosts at least a hundred men, more than half of whom are redcoats. All this for some slaves? <laughs> Hardly. The man's a commander in the King's troop, in charge of the Southgate Fort. We need to find a way inside. Hmm, let me think on it. In the meantime, I'll attend to our final recruit. John Pitt turns our man. I'll take you to him. Alright. Oh, it's me. She's still supposed to be going on like this. It sounds relevant to the game, but we'll, we'll see, I guess. State your business. New recruit. More kindling for the pyre, eh? Well, go on, then. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and just overload the checkpoint, just to see if uh, the music still be supposed to be going off like that, because that's just... I don't know, it just doesn't sound fitting. State your business. New recruit. More About kindling it, so. for the pyre, eh? Well, go on then. How'd you manage that? Did you forget, sir? My commission is with General Braddock. When I'm not attending to you, of course. Can, you fool! Your acts are treacherous. Give me one good reason. I shouldn't kill you right now. Did Were I you planning him? to announce yourself? Or did you hope my men Sir, wouldn't notice your if arrival? If you'll allow me to explain. Oh, oh, by all means. I should like very much to hear this. I have not deserted, sir. I am here under Commander Amherst's orders. Show me a letter bearing his seal. And you might be spared the gallows. I have no such thing. The nature of my work, sir. It's... It's the sort of thing best not put to paper. Hey, them. General Braddock? I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. Wolves often travel in packs. Master Pitcairn won't be here for but a few weeks. I shall return him to his proper post once our work is finished. The devil's work, no doubt. It's bad enough my superiors have insisted. I grant you use of Charles. But they've said nothing about this traitor. You'll not have him. Edward, listen to reason. We're done here. See these gentlemen out. My nice son here, by the way. Well, that didn't go as I expected. And to think I used to call him brother. What now? They'll chase us off if we try and return. We're done with this camp. But as luck would have it, so are they. Come along. 
What are you planning? To steal Master Pitcairn. What? You'll see. Now, when I give the signal, you're to distract Braddock's patrol and lure them into a dead end. So this is actually another training sequence uh, for the assassins. So uh, another thing uh, assassins are taught to do is, come, I mean, come on, Charles, really? <laughs> How do you not see you? But uh, anyways, it's to tail uh, the targets, and yeah, that's pretty much it right there. So <laughs> the tailing missions are. A normal thing. Where shall we head next? Perhaps down Marlborough? No. Its residents are too content. Their homes are nice. Their days are no, troubled. Take my spot. More men are ships free. Yes. Those fresh arrived are often soon in dire straits. They're more likely to seize upon an opportunity to fatten their purses and feed their young. Scoundrels, one and all! Boy on you and your false war! <laughs> Ew. After him! Yeah, Brown doesn't look so good on you. Unhand him, Edward. Ah, uh, you again. Let us go. And John Pitcairn with us. <laughs> I will not have my authority challenged. Nor I. Put them all in chains. Alright, well don't start crying when I you ask his beat. What the hell kind of camera was that? Ninjas. I stay my hand today because you were once my brother, and a better man than this. Or should our paths ever cross again, all debts will be forgotten. You're free now, John. Traitor! Go on then! Join them on their fool's errand! And when you find yourself lying broken... I assume broken, you've good reason for causing all this madness. What is it you require of me? I'll explain everything on the way. Today, on the last... Alrighty. Well, this is where we're gonna call the end of part two. Uh, you know, building at the boys club. We finally got our full members, but, uh, we'll go ahead and call it a sesh, so... Ah, uh, yes. Yeah. Alright. Later.